a mural on a chip shop wall in Presswich and a tribute to Marky e. Smith, the village's most famous son. I think it's uh, absolutely brilliant, amazing. Uh, Mark would be really happy and pleased and proud of it, I think, yeah. But I think Marky e. Smith really conjures up what Presswich is all about, his attitude, his approach. And everybody who knows um, Presswich knows about Marky e. Smith as well as a direct link to who we are, what we're about. Mark sadly died in January this year and the people behind the Presswich Arts Festival then commissioned artist Axie to paint the mural. It took him around the week to complete and it seems everyone is happy with the end result. It's amazing to see the finished product. We've been here last weekend and this past weekend uh, watching the artist um, start his work, working like a Trojan uh, mm. for hours to, to get it done and so it's fabulous to actually see. Presswich lad Daniel Edwards runs the chip shop. He has fond memories of seeing Mark in his local. When we were younger, we used to drink in a pub called the Woodthorpe and he used to sit in the corner there while we were playing darts and throw abuse at us. So, uh, yeah, we were, very, uh, we were very aware of Mark when we were growing up. So, yeah, he's, uh, he's synonymous with Presswich. Presswich and Mark go together. As the leader of the fall for over 40 years, Marky e. Smith forged a reputation as one of the most original voices in pop music. No one sounded or looked quite like him. And on the chip shop window here, just next to the mural, you've got some of Marky e. Smith's lyrics, a really fitting epitaph. When I'm dead and gone, my vibrations will live on. In vibes on vinyl through the years, people will dance to my waves. He'd rather have it uh, on the corner of a chipper in Presswich Village as opposed to in central Manchester, 100%, yeah. Well, I wake up here to sit up. I look around to see who's with me. Tim Scott, ITV News, Manchester.